We wrap it up on Thursday. In June of 1988, Manute Bold was scheduled to lead the Washington Bullets. That request came from the Golden State Warriors. A few years earlier, Chris Mullen was asked to join that same Warrior team. Can these two newly found friends lead their team to an NBA title? That's our new lineup right here on Dazzling Dunks and Basketball Bloopers. Quiet on the set once again. Hey, I'm John Spider Sally, the Detroit Pistons. Did you know that? Hi, I'm Xavier McDaniel, the Seattle Supersonics. When we come to play the Charlotte Hornets, what's the name of the building? Hi, I'm Chuck Purser. The NBA is your ticket to action. <laughs> is that right? Hey, I'm John Side, Detroit Pistons. Okay, hi, I'm Xavier McDaniel, the Seattle Supersonics. Uh, when we come play the Charlotte Hornets, that place better be full. Hi, I'm Chuck Purser. I want to see you when I come to Charlotte. Hi, I'm Wayman, and, and this is my man. Y'all keep y'all hands <laughs> off of him. Yeah, yeah. Yes, he's mine. <laughs> Here's a personality from the NBA. When the call went out for Daryl Dawkins, the results were inevitable. Jumping to the NBA out of high school, Dawkins made a name for himself as Mr. Dunk, and he creatively returned the favor by issuing a nickname for each of his slams. I had a turbo saxophonic delight dunk where I went up and swiveled the hips a little bit and kind of brought it across. Larry Brown, watch out! I had to dunk call your mama, and that was for anybody who jumped in front of me while I was trying to dunk. So I get up one night and I dunk a good one. The backboard's still shaking. I'm like halfway back down the floor. I look back down and still swinging. They said, what was that? I said, get out of the way and backboard swing, game delay. And if you ain't grooving, you best get moving. And everybody was like, the guy's got imagination. Former 76er coach Billy Cunningham remembers that unique imagination. He had a game every other week for a dunk. Um, I can remember him shattering the backboard in Kansas City, shattering the backboard in Philadelphia. We lost those, both of those games, by the way, every time he shattered the backboard. Well, that's why we have the breakaway rims now, because of Daryl Dawkins. Because they can still be broken. The rim only gives from the front. The rim only leans down in the front when you hit it. If you hit it from the side, it's going to break. I know I've tried these things. And who could ever doubt Daryl Dawkins, certainly one of the great characters of the game. But, Carl, can I ask you a question? I mean, is he the character that they always talk about? You know, without a doubt. Uh, I've seen him a couple of times. He's the biggest character of the game by far. Well, we have been discussing it before you got here. We want to ask you kind of a personal but a professional question. Um, have you ever uh, broken any of the back doors? Well, you know, I, I broke my shoulder. I never <laughs> like to talk about it, you know. It's, I'm it's, sure. Really, you know. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You know, I like to talk Carl, about it. Carl, there is the weirdest character over your sh other way. Other way? Do you hey, see Carl. Hey, Carl. Of course, looking all over How are you doing, yeah. man? Having a team meeting, huh? Oh, yeah, a team meeting. Looks like the team's in pretty good shape this oh, year. Oh, really good shape. Carl, you know, huh? Oh, can I join you? Yes, please, Coach. Okay. Have a seat. Thanks, Carl. Gosh, I've been looking all over for you, Carl. And i got to get your professional opinion. Now, I know you've always been a dunk man. Carl, um, i, I got to go. Woo, there goes another one. <laughs> hey, Carl, listen. Okay, have Come here, let me talk to you. Let me talk to you. Come here. Come here, Coach. You know, I always took your advice. See you later. I always took your advice. See you later. Oh, Carl, it's starting to drop like flies. Get right to the point, please. Well, what I'm here to ask you is... What is it? Dazzling dunks or basketball bloopers? What's the most important thing? Because it's got to be the characters of the game. Without a doubt, it's the Five, characters Carl. of the game. Five. <laughs> there they go. Coach, get right to the point, okay? What is it? Dunks or bloopers? What's more important? Coach, the only thing I can say right now... You're not okay? getting mad, are you? No, no, I'm not getting mad. The only thing I can say is the characters of the game, okay? Character? 
They're all characters, all these dunk guys. In its early days, the dunk was not about style. High percentage in nature, it was basketball's most straightforward shot. In the 70s, however, a growing legion of high